hello everyone welcome to obs studio tutorials in this video we are going to talk all about the audio mixer guide uh, that options all the options that are available through audio mixer that you are going to use in obs studio so after this video regarding audio mixer you won't have any questions in your mind and you would know all the tips and tricks that are provided to you by obs studio so without any further ado let us just dive right into the topic so once you have opened up your obs studio make sure you have created a new profile and a new scene collection just select that particular scene click on the plus icon in the sources and go to audio input capture so the first audio input capture I'm going to use is my mic. Click on OK. And this is going to be my Realtek audio USB microphone. Just click on OK to set it up. So as soon as I added an audio device in the audio mixer, I'm getting this particular output. So this is showing me three levels, green, yellow and red. That is actually showing the volume in which I'm speaking and it is transitioning as I'm speaking. So uh, if you want, you can just use this volume button, volume slider over here to uh, change the sound of your voice like this. Or if you want, you can just mute it altogether and then it would be grayed out. That means your no audio capture is uh, audio is not capturing right now. Then if you want to add multiple audio sources, you can simply just click on the plus icon and click on another audio capture. So let me just name it as a mic two and click on OK. Now from here, you can just select the another microphone that is a high definition audio device in my case and click on OK. So now you will see that we are getting outputs for both. In the case of mic 2, it is capturing very high volume. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to reduce this a bit so that it uh, doesn't frequently goes on the red section and it captures a good amount of uh, the audio that is being played to it or uh, uh, this is how you can adjust the audio levels now in case you have multiple audio levels suppose you add another video capture device so let me just add my video capture device as well that is uh, also going to have an audio with it so this is also having an audio with it so what i want to do is i just want to ignore the audio of my video capture device so just click on this mute icon and this audio would be muted only from these two sources that is mic and mic 2 my audio would be recorded now, uh, this seems a bit extensive as there are three devices and already all the space is taking up. So you might want to change the layout, right click or, or just click on these three dots and click on vertical layout. So this is a vertical layout for all these three devices and you can add multiple devices, four or five devices as well for a cleaner output set over here. Now you can just adjust the volumes, you can just see the output, you can mute, unmute any other devices like this over here as well. All the options you can take uh, note of. Now, in case you want to move back to the horizontal layout, just right click and click on this vertical layout, uh, uncheck this vertical layout and you're back in your horizontal layout. If you want to hide any of the devices, suppose I'm not capturing audio from the video capture device and I want to hide it, just right click on these three icons and click on hide. So that would be hidden. If you want to show all the um, hidden things, if you want to unhide them, just right click and click on unhide all and all of them would be visible at once. If you want to rename any other device, like video capture device is not very, uh, you know, uh, consistent. It's not very much um, giving any information. So just right click, click on rename and you can just uh, say that it is the same as my webcam. Click on OK. Mic 2, suppose it is for my guest. So then you can just rename it to the guest microphone. And this mic is for my host so just right click and rename it to host microphone so that is actually much better that this is the host audio that's the guest audio and that's the webcam audio okay then if you have applied some filters suppose in the host audio i go to the filters and um, let me just resize this window and here click on the plus icon and apply a compressor filter okay for a better audio quality so i've applied this compressor filter on the host audio and i want the same on my guest audio as well so just right click, go to copy filters from the host, go to guest and click on these three dots and click on paste filter. So the compressor filter would be applied from the host to the guest as well with the same settings that you have just applied over there. Then uh, if you want, you can just right click and go to properties for any of the audio sources and change its device as well. Like uh, you can just go with a default device or a microphone. You can just change between the different microphones. So that's it for the audio mixer guide all the things that you need to know in OBS Studio. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.